think we just kind of put it down the commode, didn't we, Tanya? We said we're not going to think negative. And what does the word say in Romans 12? Finally, my brothers, be not conformed to this world, but be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind. So let's just ask God within ourselves today to renew our minds. And the way that Reverend Zandra has shared with us is whatsoever is true, whatsoever is noble, whatsoever is just, whatsoever is a good report, think on these things. So if you're worried about getting a job, for example, you might say something, well, promotions don't come from the north or the south, they come from God. You think on that thing. You may not be feeling so hot. So you might say, well, he sent his word and healed them all. You think on that. You think you might be a little down and out. Well, think, you know, I'm a mighty warrior. I'm a mighty man of God. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. So like she said, jump to that word. Get it, get it, eat it up. You know, I often say that my name, Selma, means peace. And when I go to certain places, and they say, do you know that your name means peace? And I didn't realize the weight of that, you know, that, uh, so when you, and people say, why are you always so mellow? Well, they've been calling me Selma all my life. After a while, you become that. And I just thank God, and I pray to God that he leaves that spirit on me. There's a scripture I read that said, uh, cast me not from your presence, and please don't take your spirit from me, Lord. We don't want him to take his spirit away from us. So at this time, if you're out there, and you're just wondering about your life because you got the stinking thinking, and your mind's about to pop, we got the solution. You don't have to live like that. Take it from me. You don't have to live like that. If you just repeat after me, I can help you with the stinking thinking. I can help you open up your mind so that your whole spirit is brand new because when we give our lives to Christ, everything becomes new and we become a new creation in Christ. And that's some good news. So if you're out there and you want all of this, what we talk about, just repeat after me. Dear Father, I am sorry for my sins. I was wrong. I was low down dirty wrong. I was so wrong, I was wrong to wrong. The Lord, I believe in you. I believe you came to earth. I believe they crucified you. And I believe that you got up. And I want you to come into my heart and be Lord of my life. In Jesus' name, amen. The Bible says that the angels and even God himself gets, himself gets excited when a person gives their life to Christ. So they are partying right now in Jesus' mighty name. So Reverend Zandra, thank you for that message. That was cool. Stinking thinking. Put it down. If you don't know what to say, just call me. Say, Selma. And watch the peace come in Jesus' name. Now let's stand for dismissal. Mm -hmm. So may God continue to bless and keep you. May he lift up his countenance towards you and give you peace. May he bless you. May he bless you going in. May he bless you coming out. May he bless you in the city. May he bless you in the country. May he bless you richly. May he open up the windows of heaven and pour you out a blessing so much that you cannot contain it. May he do exceeding abundantly above all you could think or ask. And may he lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace in Jesus' name. Amen. We'll see you next week. Thank you for all that you do. Love you.